everyone, this is Ross in today's video. I don't really have a purpose. I don't have really an objective. I just opened up this fig, cut it open to see what it looked like on the inside, and I couldn't believe it. Um, this is honestly one of the more beautiful figs I think I've ever ripened. And I have a feeling it's gonna taste really good, but probably not as good as what you guys would imagine. Um, here's the fig right here. I mean, it's just so dark purple. The inside's almost black. The exterior's black. And the exterior, by the way, has such a beautiful color to it. You can tell this is a really well-ripened fig. Um, the skin looks like it's starting to get a little bit of mold from that moisture we had this week. But the neck is certainly starting to shrivel, so you can certainly tell that this is, without a doubt, well-ripened, incredible quality. And this is just what it's all about, guys. This is it. I want to share this moment with you guys. I mean, just look. Just look at how dark this is. What? Is this real? So, what can happen is that on the exterior here, let me put this down so you, I can really explain is that on the exterior edge not where the black skin is and not where this green is but right in the, the edge of the the pulp is a lot of times it gets dark purple when they're brabas I don't know exactly why that is no one really knows exactly why that is maybe there was a scientific study that's been done I'm not sure but that's a very common thing to see on brabas so if this was a main crop, you certainly wouldn't see that purple edge to it. Uh, however, it has happened, and there are some figs that get that purple edge. And they really, really wow fig collectors, people who grow many varieties, because we know that when it gets that purple edge to it, it's got a really incredible flavor. So I'm going to just take a bite. Cheers, everybody. Good luck this growing season. Hmm. That is good, guys. It's probably a four out of five for me in terms of flavor. Nice and soft, nice figgy flavor, a strong berry flavor, but not the intense berry flavor you would imagine. Nonetheless, um, the texture is a bit um, congealed, and it's really good. This is an incredible fig. This is LSU Scott's Black, by the way. This is a Braba. Brabas, I got about seven of them. They've been so far ripening with exceptional quality. This one probably could have went even longer. But the skin, because it's been raining, certainly is not... It's starting to deteriorate, and it's getting to that time where it's going to get moldy. So, unfortunately, if we could have completely dry weather, this would have been... Probably an insane fig, but holy hell, guys. All right. Take care, guys. Again, I just wanted to share that with you all. No real objective there. Take care, everyone. Grow some figs.